Hello everyone, this is Rich Sis, but is Matt Catsphere, and I'm here with just a fun video to help teach you guys how to uh, develop your intuition and your intention and psychonesis, um, to teach you how to follow objects, motions, um, very similar to a side wheel, and that is working with hydrokinesis. Now right here is a picture with a little small leaf, and I'm going to teach you how to make a leaf float on water and follow its motion, and how to uh, develop a control over it and intention and everything like that and what it is that this is just something that I saw online that I, I've been practicing with this too what it is that is very simple you get a small leaf you can find this in the garden or anything put some soap on it on the edge just any type of soap dishwashing soap things like that and you put it in a bowl like this something large like this and then just as you can see it's just going around crazy and what this teaches you um, what you can do is that you can practice by following its motion very closely the intricacies of its motion very closely as you would with the side wheel um, when you put a side wheel together you put a side wheel on a needle and the side wheel is always um, kind of spinning around by itself a little bit and this can also teach you how to uh, follow the object's motion and to predict develop prediction and to develop um, premonition a sense of premonition, foreseeing, being able to predict its motion so that you can project your intention ahead of time and make it stop how you want it to. So if it's going to turn a sharp left, you want to make it stop and slow down before it makes a full rotation. You do this by following the object's intricate motion. If the object is rotating around very quickly, you have to anticipate and believe that it's going to slow down at any moment. It's anticipation you believe in it. As soon as it starts to slow down, then you must believe that you made it stop. That's it. And likewise, if the object is stopped and you want the object to pick up speed and begin movement and it begins to slowly move, you have to believe that it's moving because of you and keep on pushing it with your intention and belief. This will teach you how to develop um, control of the object to predict where it's going to go, how fast it's going to go, how slow it's going to move, and being able to follow its motion very closely will allow you to develop a sense of um, development of, like I said, control, a sense of intuition, a sense of foreseeing, to be able to control the object, to stop it in place, to slowly stop it in place, to believe in the slow, steady stopping of the object, the slow, steady um, state of the object. No matter if it's moving very quickly, you have to believe in every intricate motion of the object. As you can see here, even though it's spinning around kind of crazy, you have to follow it, and you have to develop a sense of you have to uh, develop a sense of trying to stop it in place. You know that's what, wanna, what, what you want to do. Like I talk about um, what they say with side wheels, try to stop it in place, and you have to believe that you're stopping it in place, that you're stopping the object, and that when the object stops, when the leaf stops on the water specifically in this video I'm trying to teach you you have to believe that you did it and then when it starts to move you have to believe that you're making it move that's how psychonesis works that's how you develop your strength you know you guys don't know but psychonesis is very actually very easy work with light objects be proud of what you can do don't dismiss small things because that means you dismiss and disrespect yourself and you could also work with feathers or small pieces of thin plastic, like a piece of plastic bag, small piece of plastic bag, um, toothpicks. You could try to put some soap on those objects and try to see how they move. Uh, bigger leaves. Just work with hydrokinesis. Work in the motion. Believe in it. Believe in yourself. God bless. Here's an old uh, warm-up clip of me spinning a side wheel under a container. This is something you can do, guys, uh, by developing your tuition and intention with aerokinesis and hydrokinesis. You can do it. God bless.